local storm team meteorologist Chelsea Chandler with the Mid-South's most accurate forecast. This is Good Day Memphis on CW30. Coming up on 713 here on Good Day Memphis. Thanks for starting it with us. Chelsea's got her eyes on the cooler temperatures outside to start the day. Fall has finally arrived. Yeah, it is going to be a nice, cool, crisp start for us. Definitely want to grab that jacket. The one thing you won't need, thankfully, though, is any kind of umbrella. We aren't tracking any kind of rain. However, you can see the Carolinas, a completely different story as now Michael is continuing to just bear down, bringing heavy rainfall. I've seen tornado warnings. We've got all kinds of issues going on there from flooding, coastal warnings. So uh, this is still not done. Now it is moving very quickly and we'll actually see it making its uh, track uh, towards uh, right now a 50 mile per hour sustained winds. That's why it's now a tropical uh, depression, no longer a hurricane, but it'll make its way towards uh, the Charlotte area closer to about one o'clock this afternoon with 45 mile per hour sustained winds heading towards Raleigh later this evening before crossing into Virginia and then headed out to sea. So good news because it'll be leaving us, uh, but we will still be feeling those effects for a while as the Carolina is still obviously battling uh, the flooding after Florence. So we'll be keeping a quote, close watch on all of this. Uh, right now you can see all the warmer air that is making its way out with Michael because of this very strong cold front that's been pushing through. It's already made its way through our area and that nice cold air now moving in and really helping us drop those temperatures. We've seen them close to 20 degrees cooler this morning. Somerville 22 degrees cooler. Memphis 17 than it was this time yesterday. Yesterday, and that's because we're all in the 50s. Right now, 53 degrees is what it feels like in Memphis. Almost everyone feeling in those low 50s, with the exception of Corinth at 59. So, as we get through your morning, those temperatures will, of course, climb. We'll get into the 60s by 10 a.m. Some last uh, straggling clouds will get out of here this morning, and then we're going to see almost crystal clear skies all day long with beautiful sunshine as we head into your afternoon. That continues as our temperatures climb up to about 68 degrees this afternoon for your high. Now, those temperatures will steadily drop. Drop down to the 40s overnight. 47 is your low tonight. So when we start off tomorrow morning, expect it to be very crisp. So as we head towards the weekend, it looks good. It looks perfect for the Memphis UCF game uh, that is going to be uh, going on this Saturday afternoon. Uh, not expecting any kind of rainfall until later in the evening, carrying us over into Sunday with a cold front that brings us a 60% chance of rain Sunday, 40% Monday morning, dropping our temperatures Monday with a high of 58 degrees. That continues for the foreseeable future. So hopefully you enjoy these fall temperatures because they are here. We'll be tracking it, keeping you up to date with the latest on your forecast. All you have to do is follow us on Facebook. 